ओके वन ऑफ द कस्टमर्स व्हिच गिव्स यू वेरी वेरी फ्रीक्वेंट अपडेट्स और मे बी ऑलमोस्ट एवरी डे फॉर फॉर एग्जांपल फॉर रेडमी नोट 10 प्रो द रूम हैज ऑलमोस्ट वन डे अपडेट और मे बी डेली अपडेट दिस इज कॉल्ड राइज टू इट एंड द लेटेस्ट वर्जन वर्जन 4.0 इज नाउ आउट विद द लेटेस्ट सिक्योरिटी पैच एंड अ लॉट मोर न्यू थिंग्स द चेंजेस एंड एवरीथिंग आई एम गोइंग टू टॉक अबाउट इन दिस वीडियो सो स्टे ट्यून्ड एंड मेक श्योर टू वॉच दिस वीडियो टिल द एंड इफ दिस 4.0 वर्जन इज नॉट अवेलेबल फॉर योर डिवाइस स्टे ट्यून it will be available very soon if it is not yet but uh, talking about this version as expectedly we have android 12 l we have uh, the july security patches august is going on so maybe we, with the august security patch we'll see very new update very soon the first change which we got here is this navigation bar pill if you're able to notice here this navigation bar pill is by default i haven't customized the length or etc but this is by default and this navigation bar pill is inspired from android 13 and if you haven't installed android 13 or if you haven't saw my review on android 13 beta updates yet make sure to find out i have a video already available where you have some changes so google made some changes with this navigation bar pill it looks like kind of ios which you can customize if you want to another change which we found here is in this quick settings layout where you can customize the quick setting tiles layout if you want to and you can hide the titles and this is how the quick settings panel will look like so if you found this thing good for you make sure to give it a try the quick settings panel a lot of users want to customize a lot of users want to change this look etc and with the help of these options where you can enable the vertical layout you can disable the titles etc you can customize a lot of things with the help of this one so this rise to our latest version includes all these changes some of the few more changes which we found here is about this quick settings panel and that but we also found a lot of things which we will talk about later on but let's take a quick look at this app which is called LADB which basically gives you the facility which will give you a very good kind of thing that you can use ADB commands on your android without need pc which is a very very helpful thing you simply need wireless debugging and i have a dedicated video on ladb which i will give you the link in the description so go and check it out that how you can configure that and you can add some commands for example adb shell commands you can deploy your device you can use a lot of things with the adb if you don't know what you can do with adb google.com is there for example if i want to add any command here one thing let me tell you one uh, one thing i let me tell you that you don't need to type adb shell simply lead that and start your command from pm and etc etc and you're good to go the app is available on google play store and it's paid and i have some promo codes available for you so make sure to join our updates channel as soon as possible and get the promo codes get this app for free from google play store and yes maybe a very good choice for you basically local adb shell and yes this is one of the most powerful apps there make sure to give it a try and make sure to join our updates channel to get promo codes right now while while watching this video join as soon as possible after doing all those things let's get back to our video here so we also have some fonts customizations available for example in this new customization things we found extra font options even the bold fonts and the light fonts and some fonts for example the fluid sans which is actually one of my favorite ones you have these fonts by default available in fluid os we also have some me sans fonts we, uh, we saw some nothing fonts and all these font options are actually looking quite good and quite useful for you maybe if you love to do customizations on it wise fonts play an important role and yes that is available here too some samsung fonts and ios kind of fonts and as i just mentioned the bold and light both of these fonts are available but including all those things yes all the customizations which were previously added already added in this one too for example some customizations available kind of things in buttons lock screen miscellaneous for example unlimited google photos backup game space etc etc some few of the customizations related to navigation bar where you can disable the ime button navigation we also got some status bar customizations for you and some customizations and some features in system rise stride lab where you can simply enable the option for application downgrade and etc etc these are the things and these were things i just want to let you know this was about today short and simple video link for all of the supported devices is in the description thanks for watching i'll see you in the next video goodbye